Hello, my friends. Welcome to Pride 2023. This poem is fresh off the press, and it was recently published in Alien Buddha Press's Pride 2023 celebration. It's titled Polychromatic. They scoff at us because we stole June from them long ago, robbed them of their rainbows, and dressed up to read to their children in libraries. Through these hysteric lenses, we trample through monochromatic streets like politically correct kaiju. We topple warped skyscrapers, and all the while, we spit flames at the half-thought Bible verses launched at us as friendly fire. They insist when they say, why doesn't this or that group get a whole month to celebrate, then check boxes next to state-elected despots who ban the words we speak, the art we create, then remind us that they go to church, thus have every freedom to hate. And the span it takes for them to cast library books into overflowing school bins, political podiums perform as pulpits for the sake of protection. They shout, you're indoctrinating our kids, while never sparing the ultimate rod that spoiled us, the specters of fire lakes, salt pillars, and eternal damnation. Then they target stores with daggers dressed as words until the shelves are reduced, relocated, or stripped of every fleeting rainbow button and sticker etched with pride because apparently any rainbow exposure leads to moral turpitude. They berate, bully, and still squirm at the thought of us because we've become mirrors reflecting the people they're capable of being. We reflect the love we fought so long for, unfathomable to them. We refract the years of isolation into belonging, then bend their hate through the prisms we've become to cast a light they've never had. Our centuries of tears are a gentle summer storm quenching parched soil they've refused to tend. And our stories cultivate landscapes for the seeds we plant to germinate in a better world. So while their hate fades and whispers against the wind, our parading footfalls are thunderclaps, our words are lightning strikes, and our pride nitrogen rich because it takes more than just the sun to make a rainbow.